Hey, what's going on YouTube? Welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to give you guys an overview and look around Apple Fitness Plus. I'm down here in my basement gym. I've got some standard used decent equipment, but Apple Fitness Plus has given a new level to my workouts that uh, really elevate them, that challenge me to do more and do more exercises that I didn't even think of. So uh, let's jump in and start the review. All right, so let's get the review started. I have a 60 inch uh, Samsung TV down here in the basement with Apple TV hooked up right down here. I don't know if you can see it, is it in frame? Let's see. Yeah, yeah, you can see it. Uh, the Apple TV's right here. So uh, we're gonna give you a quick tour. Uh, you just start by opening Apple Fitness Plus and uh, they have a whole different uh, category of workouts here across the top. You've got hit workouts, yoga, core, strength, treadmill, uh, cycling, which I can't use because I don't have a bike down here yet, but I will eventually. Uh, rowing exercises. You have dance, mindful cool down. Haven't done a ton of those yet. Primarily, I've been doing the uh, treadmill strength and core. I've tried a little bit of the yoga, but my body doesn't quite bend that way yet. So. Uh, when you go back to the menu here, when you go to start a workout, let's say you're going to do core, click on it, you get a whole different list of various workouts with different workout uh, experts uh, or trainers, and uh, the ones with the check marks I've already done, I've already been doing, so I don't want to go back and do those again because I've already done them once. Now the cool thing about this is each one of these workouts has its own playlist, its own music uh, that the trainers have chosen. I think that's phenomenal. It's really good. My one complaint about it though is that the music's not very loud, probably so that you can hear the trainer, but uh, it's, it's good enough and it's entertaining. It's better than me just being down here on my own on a treadmill with uh, just the TV to watch, right? Who wants to watch CNN or whatever when you're working out? Anyway, going back to the menu here, uh, when you pick a workout and you click on it, uh, you get you click Let's Go, and then it'll ask you to confirm on your Apple Watch. Like it'll pop, it'll pop right up on the watch for you to click on, and that'll begin the workout on the TV. Pretty cool. So uh, that's about it. I mean, you can sort the workout types by music, by duration, and by trainers. Uh, so I think the menu interface in this system is really simple, really easy to use. Um, I'm not going to play a workout because I'm afraid I might get a copyright violation, so we're not going to go there. We're not going to do that. But uh, going back, yeah, so uh, you can sign out of the workout in the upper left corner here as well. So a couple criticisms of this, right? You can't yet work out with more than one person. So if it's me and a friend, I guess the friend could do the exercises, but their rings won't show up on the TV. That's the other thing that's cool about this. When you're exercising, when you're working out, your, uh, your rings and a burn bar will show up in the corner here. <clears throat> and over on the other side, uh, so over here it'll have your, your rings and your uh, progress in the workout and your rings will actually be over here. Sorry, I misspoke a little bit there, but you get the idea. So, you know what? I actually will click on a workout here just to show you guys how it would look. So let's say we're gonna do a yoga workout. You click on it, it shows you the name of the instructor, it gives you a little overview of what they're gonna do. Um, it even tells you what equipment you're gonna need, like a yoga mat in this case which I do have, the camera's on it, not gonna show you. So hit let's go. <clears throat> and you can see right here on my watch, it's now prompting me to start the workout. So I'll click go. And then on the TV, the workout will actually start. It'll give you a countdown to get ready. Aloha, it's Dustin. So, I'm here with Dance Trainer Dan, and my coach Anya has a... So to show you up here, it gives you the duration of the workout, which in this case I think was 10 minutes. It shows you the current heart rate, it shows you the calories, and over here it shows you your rings, your progress. So 
really interactive, really awesome. I just hope that they add the ability to work out with friends to it so that, you know, maybe your friend's rings could be down here, your friend's progress could be down here. That would be really awesome. And so right now, if you want to put this up on the TV like I have here, it only works with an Apple TV Plus for right now. I did hear recently that they're going to be uh, adding the ability to put the workouts up on a smart TV. Like I have two Samsung smart TVs upstairs, so I'd be able to put this workout up on those TVs without needing an Apple TV, but it won't put the progress bars or the rings up on the TV like you just saw. So that's a major bummer. I hope they figure out a way to make that work. I feel like if smart TVs have AirPlay capability, which the newer Samsungs do and probably some of the LGs too, they should be able to get those rings up there like that. I think that would be awesome. And I hope to see it soon. Um, so, you know, uh, just to recap, a couple downsides to Apple Fitness Plus. You have to have an Apple Watch, which can be a little expensive, although the new SEs are like $279, so it's not that bad, but still, you need an Apple Watch. You have to have an Apple TV if you want to fully utilize the Apple workouts, and the Apple TVs are kind of expensive compared to their peers, like a Roku or something like that. Um, so, uh, and you can't work out with friends. So those are a couple of the downsides. Uh, that I think kind of make this whole apparatus drawn back from what it could be. But again, this, is, this service has only been out a couple months, so I'm sure you'll see a lot of progress on it in the future. Uh, so that's my short tour of Apple Fitness Plus. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. I would really appreciate if you click subscribe down below. I always love getting new subscribers.